Hey, Jenny here. Really quick, I just want to show you, I had an experience today. I was trying on one of these masks on a friend of mine and the ears just were not, they were not staying on her ears. And so I decided, let me just make something adjustable with long straps that go behind your head. The other thing that I learned today is that if I cut that, that thick garden wire in two inch pieces instead of three inches, it just works so well on my nose. I think before it was too long and it was digging in where this is just perfect. And you don't have to do anything to it. You don't have to put duct tape around the end. You don't have to turn it under. So it's really, really quick. So to do this one, I'll show you really quick. The other thing that's nice about this is that when you're not wearing it, you can just put it around your neck it's really easy to get off and we just did instead of tying it instead of doing the beads on the sides and tying it we just let's see can you see that we just do it long so I'm just gonna show you so this will be what it looks like before you sew it down so I just took two long straps these were 16 inches long. And then I'll just finish top stitching just like I did the other one. And then I'll put the bead in through the top here instead of doing it on the side. So if you're looking for something that will still adjustable but will sit on the back of your head instead of on your ears, which some people may not like, especially if, if it's something you want to keep on, then this design works a lot better. Just slip it on, up, tighten it, just pull, pull, and with that two inch garden wire, it's super secure. So just another little improvement to make it fit a little bit better. I know everybody's different, so hope that helps.